Hey guys, it's Dave with My Freedom Smokes. Today I'm going to talk to you about a new RDA we recently picked up. It's the Peerless RDA from Geek Vape. Uh, Geek Vape is really known for their RTAs and stuff like that. We've carried a lot of their RTAs. Um, now they're kind of getting into RDAs or are making some really good RDAs. Um, we saw the Medusa, which is kind of an RDA tank hybrid type of deal. This one's going to be strictly an RDA. It's a 24 millimeter RDA, so it fits nicely on most of the modern devices and stuff out now. Um, really cool build deck they put in this guy. Um, I'll show that to you here in a moment. But um, pretty cool to see them come out with a nice RDA. I mean, I've been a fan of their tanks. Great flavor, great vapor production out their tanks. So I was kind of glad to see that they come out with an RDA. And not only do they have an RDA, they have a great build deck for it. Um, so I'll just kind of show you the build deck. Um, it's a 9 millimeter deep build deck, so a nice deep juice well on this thing. Um, cool post design to it. It's got dual post. Um, you got a positive post and a negative post. But the way they did this is the screws um, are kind of have a shoulder to them. It's a regular grub screw with a little pin on the end of it. And what that's for is if the top here is actually used for smaller builds, if you got some coils that the legs and leads don't really spread out wide, you don't really want to stretch them out and put them and larger holes for something you'd want to put a Clapton on, they give you those two holes at the top there so you, your leads can still go in for a smaller coil, but you still have the option of building larger coils on this. And just the way the screws are shaped, you can actually kind of shoulder your wires in those top holes or use the pin to, to fully pinch down and trap those wires if you want to go with a larger thing at the bottom, which I think is cool. This RDA is kind of for everybody. Uh, usually you have one that's well suited for a big coil, but you try to put your smaller, uh, more simple builds in there, they may not fit, or vice versa. You got something that fits great with your smaller builds, and then you try to put a larger, more exotic type build, and you really can't fit it in there. So they kind of look out for everybody with this, which is really cool. Uh, the screws are little uh, blue heat treated grub screws. Like I said, uh, those two in the middle are kind of, kind of got a pin to them. I can show you some of the screws in a moment. And then the ones on the outside are going to be standard grub screws. All right. Uh, kind of look up the top of it a little bit. It does get nine uh, holes on either side of it for your airflow. This can be set up for a single airflow design if you want to do a single coil. Just pop that off there. It's just got little fins on either side. And then there's your opening for your single coil build. Now it has uh, what looks to be an Ultim uh, chuff cap. It's actually just an acrylic. It's just kind of yellowish amber type color, almost like the Ultim. Uh, so it's got a good look to it, but it's actually just going to be acrylic. It's not going to be Ultim. Um, they do give you a secondary uh, cap there. Grab that out real quick. And the secondary cap just has a wide board uh, black Darwin chuff cap that can be removed. I'm not sure what actually aftermarket will fit that. It looks like a little friction fit or actually there's a ring down inside the cap. Um, I've tried a couple different ones here, like your Goon and stuff like that, but none of them really fit, so I'm not sure if there's anything out there that will fit it. But it's kind of cool they give you a different option with something that may have a replaceable drip tip in the future. Um, there may be something in existence now, but like I said, some of the ones I've tried do not fit that. Um, it does give a nice look to it. I mean, you can kind of black it out. You're still going to have your gold plated ring at the bottom from the gold plated deck. All right. Other little goodies included in the bag on the box are obviously your little Geek Vape three-way tool. You get your two Allen keys and then your Phillips on the end there. And you get your extra O-rings. Uh, they also give you a squonk pin for your 510, a little gold plate of squonk pin that's hollowed out if you want to do squonking. Um, grab some of these screws out real quick so you can kind of see what I was talking about with those screws. There's a screw, as you see, the top set portion of there is actually what would be going down. It's kind of got a little shoulder to it, uh, so it can kind of go down and pinch your leads in the bottom part of those uh, build, whereas the top section can shoulder that stuff in there. So it goes in there just like that. And that way you can use the different build sections to it. Um, you can actually reconfigure your stuff different ways too. Um, where you can use maybe some of your leads going to bottom holes, some go on the top. If you want to do verticals, you can kind of do it that way. Um, kind of do it more like a velocity, where you got top and bottom, top and bottom. Um, it's real versatile as far as the build you can do on this thing. Let's see, I'm running 
what do I got here? So fused Clapton's 0.14, run at 80 watts. All right, get the airflow wide open using the acrylic cap. That airflow is really smooth on that with that airflow wide open. And I like the way the shape of the cap is with kind of rounded, fits perfectly into your mouth when you're trying to vape on it. Instead of like a smaller drip tip or a big open chuff cap, the angles are kind of weird. It's real comfortable uh, drip tip to use. The cool thing is the way that post is split, you can actually just drip right through your drip tip too and, and actually hit your coils. Go ahead and re-wet it real quick. Oh yeah, some great flavor off of that. It was a great little flavor RDA. But vapor production is pretty good on it as well. So it's kind of a best of both worlds. Like I said, it's real versatile, whereas flavor, cloud, Small coils, big coils, pretty much whatever you're gonna throw at this thing, it can take it. Uh, it comes in a wide range of colors. I only have the silver and the black out here now, but there's a blue, there's a magenta, and a gold color as well that we carry. Uh, if you have any questions about the Peerless RDA by Geek Vape, please leave them in the comments below. As always, this has been Dave with My Freedom Smokes, and thank you for vaping.